All right, so for this movie, we got raging sharks. These sharks are raging. They're fucking furious. I want happy sharks next. But for now, we're going to look at raging sharks, which came out in the early 2000s, along with Shark Zone and Shark Attack and Shark Attack 2 and Shark Attack 3. Let's just get right into the raging fucking sharks. So the plot of this movie is pretty funny, actually. Basically, in space, an alien spaceship falls into the water or some shit, and it gives off, like, magnetic pulses or some crap that enrages the sharks and makes them kill people. That's pretty funny, and I guess it's original enough. There is a bunch of other stuff going on in this movie, but I'm not going to go into depth about it, really. The story, it actually does get a pass here. It was decent enough and had some originality. In terms of shark screen time, it was nowhere near the amount that I wanted. I wanted to see these sharks fucking pissed, and I didn't get that. It really wasn't that much, and aside from the beginning, you don't really see that these sharks were even enraged to begin with. So there was just not enough screen time for me. Now, my next issue is the reused footage. See, there's a reason I reviewed Shark Attack 2, then Shark Zone, and now Raging Sharks all in a row. They all use the same fucking footage. Now, Raging Shark, they don't do it anywhere near as bad as Shark Zone. It has a decent amount of original scenes with the sharks but it has reused footage from Shark Zone which had reused footage from Shark Attack 2. How fucking lazy are these studios where they're reusing shark footage, like tons of it. The first half of Raging Sharks has a decent amount of reused footage, it's just a joke. Like the weather in the original shark movie footage was like, the original Shark Attack footage has different weather than the weather that shows up later in the movie, it's just so inconsistent. Like, and it it comes down to half and half with reused footage and new footage. It's just there's multiple inconsistencies when Shark Attack 2's footage shows up as well. Like, I'm just not impressed at all. I mean, I'd rather have shit shark screen time than reused because reused is just boring. But how are the shark kills? They're not that great. Like I said, some of them were reused, so those get a zero. But there were one or two, maybe even three original shark kills. These were, though, as standard and generic as it gets. They really added, like, nothing to the movie. I felt they were just generally boring, and they just, they might as well have just reused the fucking footage. That's how boring these were. Now, the sharks, they look good. They definitely look good in this movie. They look better than most shark movies that are released nowadays. But unfortunately, like I must repeat, this is reused footage. And it not only, it's just, the new kills... And the new sharks look identical to the old ones. So it makes it even harder to distinguish if these are new shots or not. But I know that these are because I've watched these three movies back to back to back. So they look good, but it's not exactly new stuff. This brings me to the acting. I don't really have much to say about the acting. It wasn't complete shit like Shark Zone, but it wasn't exactly better. It was almost on Shark Attack 2's level. But I just generally found I was not impressed. I found a few parts to be quite humorous that involve cussing. And just generally didn't care for the acting. I felt really indifferent towards it. Because some of the writing of this movie wasn't exactly great. The explanation with the aliens was quite silly. But I just feel they didn't really talk about the sharks like at all. And I wasn't really happy. There was this black ops guy throughout the movie or whatever. And his entire plot line and acting was just really stupid and made me just not care about it. And so I just didn't care and I didn't take any notes on it. So I guess it wasn't so bad that it was good. It was just moderately mediocre. But I will say at least it seems like they almost tried. Almost. And here we are at the overall pretty fucking fast again. This is the second time I'm going to say it. Stop reusing stock footage from other shark movies. It's fucking annoying. When I see this, it just makes me feel that the... People who created this movie were so fucking lazy when they made this movie, and in return, it makes me really fucking lazy when it comes to reviewing a sh this shark movie. And to my knowledge, I don't think there's any really other shark movies that do this so far. And that's why I watched and reviewed these three movies in a row to get them out of here. And to honestly compare if what I read online was correct, which it was, it said online that these three movies all have the same footage, and they do. So while the story might actually be original and the acting isn't so fucking horrible, I really wasn't impressed with the rest of the movie. It is better than Shark Zone, but I gave that movie a 1 out of 5. The shark kills were generally boring, generic, and a lot of them were really just reused. 
I was generally bored with the movie. I was on my phone a good portion of the time. It's just like I couldn't even give a shit about this movie. When they want to use reused footage like that, you turn my attention span off. Story was original, but it doesn't save the movie. And unfortunately, I mean, I'm I'm just going to have to give this movie another 1 out of 5, honestly. Like, the story was great to an extent, like in terms of originality. But I'm sorry, more reused footage, just me being generally bored, and it just, no. I When it looks like they don't give a shit about the movie, I don't either. So you're really just in the fucking pipes on this one. It's better than Shark Zone, but I also gave that one a 1 out of 5. This one would have, it was really close to getting a 2 out of 5 from me. But then I just slept on it some more and was like, man, I was on my phone for a bit of the movie. I just didn't give a shit what was going on. And so I can't give a movie that I don't give that much of a shit about a 2 out of 5. Needs more crazy shark kills and some more plot threads or something. I don't know. Hopefully the next review I have doesn't have any reused footage because I'm fucking sick of this. Have a nice day.